members of the Momo Divisional Participatory Follow-up Committee meeting for the evaluation of projects realized from the public investment budget have met to take stock of the concrete situation on the ground in terms of physical realization. The third quarterly follow-up meeting that took place on Wednesday, October 13, 2021, in the conference hall of the Momo Divisional Delegation of Labor and Social Security began with a field visit to project sites. The first stop was at the Mbengwe Council building that is currently being renovated. Here, the mayor, Ndangsa Kennedy Akam, led the delegation around the various offices where work is being carried out, explaining what's been done this far and what's still to be done. For years now, the situation of the Mbengwe Council building had been a call for concern with several leakages, poor piping and water getting into offices and the town hall when rain falls including dirty walls caused by the leakages. A contract was thus awarded this year for the renovation of the building and work has been ongoing. The mayor used the opportunity to present a trophy he recently backed home to the follow-up committee executive. On October 4, 2021, the Mbengwe Council won a 40 million prize for being the cleanest municipality in the northwest region. This comes not long after some months back, Ndangsa Kennedy also emerged as winner of a competition for the best mayor in the northwest region. From the council building, the delegation made the second stop at the Mbengwe District Hospital entrance where the council is currently constructing market stalls. According to plans, the street from the hospital entrance to Sa S M Mbengwe will in future be converted into the commercial avenue of Mbengwe. Just as is the case in Bamenda, the Mbengwe Council is currently building stalls that shall be given out for rent, thus generating income for the running of the affairs of the council. At the moment, eight stalls are under construction and according to plan, there will be a ground and up floor, thus giving a total of 16 for the start. The last project visited was a water catchment in Wumrati, said to be the highest summit in Bengui village. Climbing up and down the hill to the catchment site wasn't an easy task for the committee president. The Honorable Injo Fungang Prudencia, member of parliament for Momo East constituency, but she remained determined. These politicians understand the situation on the ground, that it's not as bad as many think or say, reason why they still penetrate such areas to evaluate projects meant for the betterment of the living standards of the population that's been suffering. At every project site, questions were asked and the mayor gave clarifications. After the field visit to project sites, the business of the day was later engaged in the conference hall of the Momo Divisional Delegation of Labor and Social Security where 2020 and 2021 big projects for Batibo, Widikum, Andek, Njikwa and Bengwe were evaluated. According to statistics from the Momo Divisional Delegation of Minepat, a total of 57 projects were allocated to the division for the year 2021 to the tune of 1,139,106,000 francs, out of which 17 have been completed, 21 not started, and 19 ongoing but not completed, thus giving a financial execution rate of 11.33% and physical execution rate of 29.52%. The Mbengwe Council has always been leading the rest in the division in the realization of BIP and council projects. At the end of the follow-up meeting, Mbengwe Online spoke to the committee's president. I'm very impressed with the meeting today, very impressed with the rate of participation, very impressed with the rate of execution. We went down to the field and visited some projects, amongst which we have uh, the construction of uh, stores, the Mbengwe Council has constructed some stores. They want to come up with a commercial avenue at the level of Bengui. That is very enterprising, it's very encouraging because by so doing, it's going to encourage many business people to come up. There's also the rehabilitation of the water project at my 19. I was very impressed with the rate of execution of the project because the project has gone more than 80% realization. Uh, the rehabilitation of the social affairs uh, building, the re a divisional delegation too, is ongoing, but there was a major problem there at the level of the studies because the amount that was allocated was really far below the expected amount for realization. At the level of the committee, we said that uh, it is useless 
to do poor job, but that the amount that was allocated should be used judiciously, and what is pending, the uh, the, the technical bench should, as well as the vote holder, they should write the exact situation of the project that will be sent to the minister so that the minister can be conscious of what is left for the project to be fully realized. Um, I think that uh, coming back to the meeting proper, the participation rate has been encouraging. For those who could not make it for one reason or the other, we call on them and encourage them to endeavor to come. For the projects that have not started, uh, the problem has been because of uh, the difficulties on the terrain, but uh, the mayors on the field are also making efforts to ensure that work should at least start. Um, stakeholders were encouraged that projects that are tabled, once allocation is being made, they must do all possible to ensure that such projects are executed. Uh, we have a major project of the route. Allocations have been made for rehabilitation, but the problems that they are facing there now for that work to be done is the security challenges because having access to go there and so on. But as we can see, the government is doing much to ensure that the people are comfortable, to ensure that the road situation is improved upon. It is left on us as the beneficiary community to accompany the contractors to see into it that projects that have been allocated should be fully realized. I want to thank you all for giving me the opportunity to express my view on today's meeting. I think I'm very, I'll be leaving the place very satisfied with the rate at which all the mayors are trying. For those who are lagging behind, the committee frowned at their attitude because, you know, our attention was drawn from the technical departments that some mayors are not collaborative. And we have taken note of such mayors. Observation letters will be put to draw their attention and to enable them to sit up so that together in the division we can all move forward. Thank you.